Hello, Kate here. I hope everyone is enjoying the beautiful weather today. It's a little on the chilly side, but not as cold as the other night when I was shaking holding the camera. Um, so today I have been reading from my book, Do One Thing Every Day That Centers You. It's a mindfulness journal. Um, Self-care is about a lot more than getting massages and practicing yoga and, you know, doing all that stuff. It's about your mindset and it's about the way you think about things. And <clears throat> the quote that I read today was, flow with whatever may happen and let your mind be free. Stay centered by accepting whatever you are doing. So what I'm reading, you know, that no matter what you're doing each day, you can take a minute to um, like be grateful for whatever it is that you're doing. Um, even if you're not doing exactly what you had planned or if things aren't going exactly the way you pictured them going, um, you can still take some time to be grateful for what you do have. <clears throat> um, I've talked about this in, in other videos that grateful, um, being grateful is an emotion that will raise your vibration and can make things, make you feel better um, physically and emotionally. Um, and you know, when things aren't going perfectly, as the quote said, um, flow with whatever may happen. So <laughs> even if it, if, if things aren't going the way you expected and, and things are happening that are out of your control, realizing that those things are out of your control and, um, just flowing with it, that can help you stay centered even when you feel like you're not in control. You can still be centered. You can still um, have um, good self-care and you can still feel good about it, even about things, even when they don't go exactly the way you want them to. <clears throat> Another quote that I like and that I repeat often um, you can ask my family and friends, I do repeat it often, <laughs> is that life is 10% what happens to you and 90% how you respond to it. So if things aren't going your way, but you keep a positive outlook, wow, is that the moon behind me? Or is that just a light? I think it's just a light. Never mind. <laughs> I'm sorry that distracted me. Um, See, things are not going the way I expected just now, and now I'm distracted and I've <laughs> lost what I was saying, but that's okay because I'm going to flow with it. <laughs> um, <laughs> I did not plan that, I promise. <laughs> it seems like I might have, but I did not. <laughs> um, anyway, I remind, <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm looking at my notes to try to remember where I was. Um, I do tell my family, I remind my family often when, um, they're feeling upset or overwhelmed because things are not going the way they planned and the way they want them to go. I remind them that, you know, night, the way you view the world, the way you view the events that are happening to you <clears throat> right now and the way you are looking at them and the way you are interpreting them is going to create the experience that you have. And you can turn some really negative things into positive experiences just by changing your mindset and changing the way you're flowing with it. Um, so that is my, my, knowledge that I want to share for the day. So uh, just remember, I'm going to read it again. 
flow with whatever may happen and let your mind be free. Stay centered by accepting whatever you are doing. So, and it says um, the like journal prompt for this quote is how I went with the flow today. So if you're having one of those days where things aren't quite going right, how did you kind of bring yourself back to being centered and go with the flow? Thank you for being with me and I hope that you subscribe and stay tuned for more fun stuff. Thank you.